Hey, are you ready for some hunting on the Tommy Wilcox Show? Tommy Wilcox Outdoors is brought to you by Alabama Credit Union. Feel good about your money. Mahindra Tractors, built for the long haul. Peach Outdoors, get the motor running on your next project with our Mahindra Tractors, ATVs, or lawn equipment. Tuscaloosa Toyota, one price, one place. Real tree camouflage, family, friends, and the outdoors. Game face turkey calls. When you head to the woods, bring your game face. Talladega County Exchanges for all your feed and agricultural needs. All music courtesy of country music legend Hank Williams Jr. Hey folks, welcome to today's show. We got another great turkey show for you. Today's guest is going to be Don Saylor. Don is the owner and call maker for Straight Creek Calls. Don also builds our Bama Hammer, our All-American, and our Slate Calls. He does a fabulous job on slate and glass calls. And if you want to know more about him, just go to straightcreekcalls.com. Uh, he's got a lot of great calls. On this particular hunt, he always comes and hunts with me. And we get to showcase the Bama Hammer or the All-American or whatever we're doing that day. And uh, we had some turkeys answer us. And uh, some turkeys come out in the field. And before long, we had Mr. Big, the big gobbler, come out. Y'all take a look. Hey, folks. We're in uh, Fayette, Alabama. I'm with Don Saylor, Straight Creek Calls. Don builds the Bama Hammer for me, the All-American and uh, my game changer slate. And uh, we try every now and then to get together and do a little turkey hunt. And we came out here early this morning and the birds weren't doing anything. We couldn't get, I mean, they wouldn't gobble. They, they, wouldn't, uh, they wouldn't do nothing. It was just one of those dead mornings. We know a big front's coming through tonight, so that might have them a little messed up. So what we're doing is we're gonna hunt the middle of the day. We decided to come out and sit on this. Uh, we checked our game cameras and there's about seven or eight hens, some jakes, yeah. and a long beard sitting in here. So you ready, Don? I'm I'm ready. Hopefully they'll come back in here this afternoon. How did you calls how how's business going so far this year so far? It's it's going pretty good. It's uh it's slowing down now that turkey season's in. Uh, but we've had a good year. Can't complain about it. Well good. Well, I tell you, man, I appreciate the Bama Hammer and the All-American, those calls. We have killed so many birds with those. We've had, uh, we've got multiple Grand Slam and Royal Slams with them. So you do a good job, man. I appreciate that. I'm glad able to build a good call for you. Well, proof's in the pudding, man, and we can certainly, if you go to our site, you can see the amount of birds we've taken with them, so. And we're gonna we're gonna hunt a little bit since it's middle of the day. We're gonna hunt a little bit with the T box box call, and the Bama hammer, and uh, we're gonna try to call and see if we can't get that flock of birds to come in. And Don will put the smack down on them. I hope so. Yeah. Don't miss. <laughs> <And> I, <laughs> I'll do my best not to. <laughs> All right, y'all sit tight, and uh, we're gonna see if we can call y'all in some birds.
the shot, my man. <laughs> <laughs> my goodness. That was... I thought it was going to work out there. I know. I mean, it's crazy how... I mean, we almost... I mean, he was the first one to come out. And usually, all these other ones have been coming out. The hens have been coming out. And then some jakes have been coming out. Well, my gosh, he come out, didn't he? Yeah. It's a good bird, man. Hey, <laughs> congratulations, man. Yeah. Hey, listen. I know you can't see it because Don built that call, the Bama Hammer, yeah. and that's what did it, man. All right, man, let's go get this bird, man. Congratulations. Bring your game face call. Bring your game face call. Chalk up another goblet to my game face call. Chalk up another goblet to my game face call. You better bring your game face, game face calls. Don, congratulations, man. Hey, man. Big, mature bird. Yeah, I dandy one. I tell you, man, what a, we hunted this morning, everything was dead. And uh, we came and checked some game cameras over in this field. For about three hours, this turkey was out here strutting this morning. We over in the woods. Yeah. So uh, me and Don said, let's go get us a bite to eat. We'll come back and see if we can get him middle of the day. We got on the the uh, Bama hammer. But he did. I mean, he snuck in. He snuck in with some hens and I think a couple jakes. But uh, you put that 870 <laughs> on him, didn't you? <laughs> All he did was lay and flop. Well, congratulations. This is your first one of the 2018 season? It is. That's my first one. I know you kind of <laughs> botched one the other day, but this makes yeah. up for it. Man. Yeah, it did. All right, folks. We're going to take a quick commercial break. Congratulations, Don Sailor, Straight Creek Calls. Don, if somebody wants to see about your calls, where do they need to go to? They can go to Mark's Outdoors and get them. They can go to... Uh, Sportsman's headquarters in Montgomery, uh, uh, Sure Ooh. Shot in Alexander City. And you've you got a website, too. i got too. a website, straightcreekcalls.com. Straightcreekcalls.com. Y'all check them out. He builds some great calls. Congratulations again, Thanks, man. Tommy. <laughs> hey, folks, welcome back to the show. We're in Fayette, Alabama. These birds come off the roost this morning, got hinned up. We've seen them with four or five hens. There's two gobblers. And uh, it was to the point where we couldn't do nothing with them, so we decided to back off. And uh, I've got a field not too far away from where they uh, flew down. They're usually piddled around a little bit with the hens and then come out in this field and strut and all. Got them on uh, game cameras, so sit tight. Give them about an hour and uh, see if we can get a couple of these birds to come in here and answer our calls. Uh, it's a little windy today, so I'm going to use the tee box from Game Face Calls, and I'm going to use the Bama Hammer. With both of those, I ought to be able to get you a good bird coming in. So sit tight, and uh, we'll try to make something happen for you. He's gobbling, so.
got a feeling he's gonna come flying in here, so sit tight. Hi, I'm Barry Keller. And I'm Jamie Griffin, manager at Mid-State Farmers Co-op in Columbia, Alabama. You ever planted your food plot and thought you did everything right and the food plot just didn't perform? Well, the first step to fixing your problem is to get a soil sample. Your soil fertility is the most important aspect of planting your spring or fall food plots. You can pick up a soil sample kit at any co-op or extension office near you. And once you get those results in, come by and see us at one of our four co-op locations and we can tell you exactly what you need to get the perfect green field to draw those turkeys in. And once you get your fields prepared, be sure to put out your game cameras for scouting. There are your eyes 24-7 when you're not in the woods, so you can start pattering your turkeys activity and outsmart the big old Tom. And be sure to stop by any of our Talladega County Exchange locations, Pell City, Asheville, Columbiana, or Talladega for any of your feed, seed, fertilizer, or chemical needs. And don't forget your Tommy Wilcox turkey calls.
How's that for a midday hunt? Wow. He come out strutting. Had some hens with him. I'll tell you, it's crazy. I got into this little homemade blind and I hit that tee box. Man, I hit the tee box just a couple times and I mean, right off the bat he gobbled. Right off the bat he gobbled. And uh, wasn't very long after that, I had three hens come out. He started gobbling, called them right back and uh, called them right back down the hill. And uh, they did what they had to do. I sat here, waited a few minutes, broke out the Bama hammer, just yelped a little bit. And uh, sure enough, here comes these hens in. And right behind the hen was this gobbler. It just struck me. Beautiful in the sun. Oh, man, he looked beautiful. But that was a, that was an exciting hunt. Let's go take a look at this bird. All right, folks, we got a really nice two, two, two and a half, three year old. Look at that rope. Big old rope on him. Had four or five hens with him. I tell you, I come in here and got on that tee box because I couldn't do nothing with them this morning. They were hinned up, so I started to come back in here midday. And I just took that tee box and kind of yelped on it a little bit. Boom, he gobbled. Had some hens come out. I thought he was going to come out behind them. And uh, he wound up standing in the woods gobbling. The hens went back to him. Well, I didn't hear nothing for about 45 minutes, so I got on the Bama hammer and those hens come out first and then he come out strut. Really nice Alabama bird. I'm telling you now, if you can't get them off the roost, come back out in the middle of the day. Really improve your rod. Don't give up on them. That's all I did today. Nothing special, just uh, was consistent and uh, persistent. You gotta have patience if you want a turkey hunt. Hey folks, welcome back to the show. That's gonna do it for this week. I want to thank Don Saylor of Straight Creek Calls uh, for coming along on the hunt and having a successful hunt. I also want to thank him for building the majority of my game face calls. If you're looking for a great slate or glass call, Don builds some great calls. And it's backed up by our multiple grand and royal slams that we've done right here at uh, Tommy Wilcox Outdoors. And, I always tell Don all the time, I want to give my friends and, and, and people that watch the show the best call on the market, and yours is definitely, uh, the ones you build for us are definitely one of the best on the market, and we appreciate it. Folks, if you want to look, find out more about Don Saylor, you can go to straightcreekcalls.com and uh, check out any information on him. And don't forget to check us out next week, which will be our last turkey show of the 2000. 18 turkey seasons. We'll see you then. Thanks. Gassed up, loaded down, trucking on from town to town. Guns, bows, and a tackle box. Here come Tommy Wilcox. Hitting the water, hitting the woods. That Bama boy sure got it good. Always having too much fun. Lord, it don't y'all